but let's take a closer look at Floppy this week. After doing the dev blog uh, two weeks ago about Lost River coming to uh, Wolf Quest Anniversary Edition, we realized that, of course, many players are new to Wolf Quest and have not seen Floppy in the old game. And uh, for that, I apologize for not explaining it better in that video. So let's do that now, better late than never, right? So there's really two stories of Floppy. There is the story of how Floppy might have come to be in the game scenario. And then there's a story about how Floppy came to be in the development of Wolf Quest 2.7. So in late 2016, we decided to add Moose, a new animal, to WolfQuest. And we, I was setting that up, and I realized that Moose have this thing. It's called a bell or a dewlap. It's a flap of skin that hangs underneath the Moose's chin, and it swings around when the Moose moves. Here you can see it working in the game now. Nobody really knows what it's for. There are some theories. Maybe it's used for communication during the rut. Maybe the size of the dewlap is an indicator of dominance to other bulls? Well, nobody knows. Anyway, I thought it'd be cool if the bell on our moose did swing around like that when they moved. So I got a nice little component called Dynamic Bone for Unity, and it's designed to do just this. It's for body parts that move around, kind of semi-independent, but also based on motion, designed for, you know, ponytails, other bouncy parts of the body. So you attach this strip to the animal, and then all these variables you can tweak to get just the right kind of movement that you want. But I didn't quite read the instructions right, and so I actually attached it to the bell down here deep inside the structure of the moose model, and then assigned the, the whole animal body to it. What I should have done was put the script on the, the parent object of the animal, and then assign the bell to it on the script component there. I did it backwards, so in effect, the entire moose is hanging from the bell instead of the bell hanging from the moose. So this is what that looks like. Pretty nice as bloopers go. It was entertaining for some people. And then amongst the beta testers who were testing this new uh, version with, with moose, uh, Nimara, who's a long time WolfQuest player, forum moderator, beta tester. She said, why don't you put that moose in the uh, BCE facility in Lost River so you can ward off trespassers. So that was a tempting idea. And you know, Lost River is a place where Almost anything can happen. And voila, it's a feature, not a bug. And then with the beta testers, we brainstormed, you know, what, what, what's the name of this thing? And Solitary Howl, another beta tester, came up with code name Modal, Moose on the Loose. And we all liked that a lot. So that was the official name initially, but then the players in their infinite wisdom dubbed her Floppy. And Floppy she's been ever since. And over time, rather to our surprise, Floppy became near and dear to the hearts of many WolfQuest players. And it was great to see all the comments uh, about Floppy in our video two weeks ago about Lost River. Um, a lot of great comments, one that really stuck with me, and I'm sorry I can't find it to show it here, but somebody said they spent a good number of hours one evening in multiplayer just hanging out near Floppy's enclosure and basically giving guided tours to floppy to all the new players who were joining that evening. So that's the kind of thing that you don't expect as a game developer, but it really makes the whole thing worthwhile to hear about players getting into the game that much. So thanks for all your comments on floppy, and like you, we can't imagine WolfQuest without her. As I said in the video about Lost River, we're going to do a greatly expanded version of Lost River later this year, and uh, there's only one floppy of course, but we've got ideas for other cool things that uh, we'd like to put in that map. Uh, we'd like to hear your ideas too. So if you've got something that would be very special, very particular for Lost River, post it below and uh, we'll look them over. Oh, and what's the real story with Floppy in Lost River in the game? Well, wolves may wonder, but they will never know. Mm -hmm.